So now, you and I can finally talk about why I chose to save your life and why I have brought you here, Mr. Valmoria. Just call me Lito, madam. Lito. Before I became First Lady, the life I lived was similar to yours. That said, I don't think I need to explain to you how I came to know about the 10 billion drug transaction you had with Renato Hippolyto. But I still want to know why you saved me and brought me here. Because I saw potential in you, Lito. It would be a waste if I just stood by and allowed Renato Hippolyto to kill you. I know him very well. He is not the type to let you walk away alive, especially after you made him lose such a huge amount. So at this point, Renato Hippolito has become your nemesis. That's why I'm saying we should start working together, Lito. He is our common enemy. He is a demon. I intend to make him pay for what he did to me. Jacob, how are you? <laughs> Still alive and kicking? You know, bad guys like us don't exactly go down easily. You better get well soon, Jacob. We have plenty of business to take care of. There's still so much for us to do. I'm going to meet with Vera right now. I have to look for a replacement for Lito. I really need to find someone to do all the dirty work for me while I'm busy here at the palace. There is absolutely no need for me to tell you who I really am. But know that I am not a simple first lady. I am also a businesswoman. That I can understand. Renato and I used to be business partners. I built the laboratory that produced the drugs worth 10 billion. I spent money on that. It was my money that bastard used. He is greedy. He claimed our business as his own. 